Hello, Ed, Ed, and Linda. Here we are, watch Gene Nelson, your realtor, and I'm walking you through Melody's house so you can see the condition. Um, there's a lot of stuff left, odds and ends. Um, some of it, like uh, the clock on the mantle. We'll make a nice staging piece for marketing, so some of it can stay, um, but then there's other things we may want to run to the dump with. Anyway, I want to walk in the living room. There's the kitchen. And I'm going to turn around now. There's the dining room. Not too bad, really. Just a lot of heavy cleaning needed, I think. And then, here we go. See, she, like, she left her um, TV and, and uh, DVD player. That's what I'm trying to say here. Um, and then she left a plant. So, but one thing I do want you to notice here is the condition of the carpet. I know that one uh, carpet cleaner has refused to come back the last time she tried to have it clean. A lot of staining, um, and I believe there's an issue with the pad, but I've found a great uh, guy, I'm going to tell you more about that later, that can come in and let us know about how much urine is actually under here on the pad and what we can do about that and so i opened the windows and the slider is open to let out some of the cigarette smoke smell but i found a great guy to help us with that too i think that's probably the first order of business is to get that cleared up and then a deep cleaning so i'll take you into the kitchen um the countertops are in good shape not bad at all um, then the the floor, there's issues on the flooring. I'm not sure what all that is. I'd say we, again, start with a deep clean. She took the fridge because uh, she didn't want to have one in her other place. And then the pantry. Here's that. And then, I don't want to scare you, but here's the sink. Full of cigarette butts. Easy to get rid of that, though. And then we're going to move around here to... The bedrooms and um oops should turn the lights on first sorry about that let me take care of the bathroom not too bad there's some staining on the floor which i suspect is cat urine from the smell um shower's not in bad shape there is this is the second bedroom again the bunk beds and stuff like that are Probably good selling features in a vacation home, um, and a lot of a lot of things in Eagle Crest do come with furniture, so that's not a bad idea. We ought to wash up these linens and freshen everything up. I think, and the, all the Venetian blinds need cleaning. That's not a hard job for someone that knows what they're doing. Um, laundry area. There are some areas of the walls and. Uh, this is just one example. There's markings on the walls, but I say we have the cleaner go over the walls real good with TSP and see where we are from there. And then, like, here's another example. And um, see uh, how much we can get out with a cleaning and maybe do a little painting. We'll talk about that. This is another downstairs bedroom with a walk-in closet. Um, and the bunk beds again. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to turn this off now and then go upstairs and do another video up there.